Hello! Welcome back to Beauty Crime. Today I have another first impression and review for you. This is Italica Bubble Mask Bio Detox. It comes in a little fantastic box, so I will link that unboxing here in case you want to check it out. And it is a bubble mask. It's a cheat mask. So, you know, you put that on your face, it foams up, bubbles, and then you have to remove it and wash your face. So I did clean my face. You probably can't see it, but I did clean it. It has a lot of text on Like There's so much text on the back. There's so much text in the front. It is a oxygenating bamboo charcoal anti-pollution mask. Purifies and unclogs, illuminates the complexion and moisturizes and soothes. And over here you have how to use it. Unfold the mask and lay, lay it on a clean and dry face. Leave on for 10 minutes. A fine dense layer of micro bubbles forms. And then number three is remove mask and number four is rinse with clear water. Bubble mask by detox combines the bamboo charcoal to visibly purify the skin. Uh, probiotic waste extracts for visibly healthy skin and thousands of micro bubbles to visibly tone the skin. Skin is unclogged, moisturized and soothed. Face is illuminated, radiant with purity. You do not apply to lip region and follow the instructions for use. So you just you just you can do that. Um I'm a little scared because I like I don't really like the tingly feeling you get with bubble masks, but you know what? I'm gonna do it for you. So open it up. She smells good. What does that smell like? I don't know, but it smells good. Oh, it's so wet. Jesus Christ, this is dripping. Perfect Halloween, isn't it? Shut up. Oh. So cold. Oh my god, it's so... What is... There you go. Hm. It's not really fitting my face. Like this. So I'll leave it on for 10 minutes. And do nothing. It feels really weird. Like, it's just so wet. Ooh, leaving it on for 10 minutes, that's that's gonna be nice. Like, really nice. Also, I don't know if you can hear, but it's actually bubbling. Hold on. It's so weird. Is it foaming up? I guess. I don't know. Like, 8 more minutes. 8 minutes and 30 seconds. Uh, yeah, so, I'll see you then. Okay, so I am back. Uh, it's still, I don't know if you can see, like, a minute or so to go. But I feel like it's getting a bit too close to my eye. I'll just zoom in a little. Can you see? It's getting too close to my eye and it's getting on my lips too. This eye is nice, but this eye is just a little bit too close. I feel like whenever I blink, I just touch it. So, you know, I just want to remove it. And also, that face mask is, or that cheat face mask is not made for my face, okay? They say to leave out the lip thing, but this part here is so big. It's no matter what I do, it's always touching my lip. So, let's, let's just remove it. I actually left it on longer than the other, and I did foam up nicely, as you can probably see. How am I? Like, just off, right? Ha! Okay, so... It's still bubbling. Okay, but now I'm gonna wash my face. So... Last check-in, uh, I washed my face, I put some cream on, and I don't know if you can see, but my face is kind of red. It feels tight, you know, it hurt a little. Maybe that's because it is actually purifying and deep cleansing, deep cleansing, deep cleansing, why am I so out of breath, Jesus Christ, deep cleansing my face, but it kind of hurts, you know, it's like, I'm going to zoom in, let me see better. Do you see how red it is over there and here? Like, I feel like these breakouts weren't there before. Also, this little cream. It just feels very tight. Oh, my nose is so red. Why is my nose so red? <laughs> Jesus. Um, it was okay. Like, I still don't really like that tingly, bubbly feeling on my face. And the camera doesn't look like it, but in reality, my face is actually red or redder than usual. Because no matter what I apply on my face, it's never red. And I can see it. I also feel like my skin is heating up a little bit. So, I don't know. Like, maybe it's a charcoal. I don't know what it was. But, yeah, do you see a difference? Is it cleaner? I mean, it feels nice. It feels very soft. It actually feels clean, like you don't really feel my 
dirty pores. I think it did an okay job apart from the fact that my skin is weirdly reacting to it. It's still very warm. Yeah, even when I touch it, it's warm. And also here, it hurts around my nose and on my upper lip. So I'm not really sure about it, but it was okay. Apart from the fact that I have some bad reactions to it. So maybe just because I have bad reactions doesn't mean it's bad. If you know, if you want to try it out, try that for yourself. I don't know how much it is. Mm, it's, mm, I don't know. <laughs> so this again was the Talika a bubble mask by Detox. It wasn't that bad. It, it hurts a little, but it's not that bad. That was it. I hope you enjoyed this. Let me know what you think. Have you tried anything by Talika? What is your favorite mask? I, I love the ones that look, you know, those peel off masks. Are they still a thing? Because they were back in no, 2012, 2010. Those were a big thing and I just loved pulling them off my face. Oh my god, that was so satisfying. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. Let me just put some lip balm on. I feel like that whole ma mascara, but the whole mask just dried on my face, like from, from top to bottom. Um, so I hope you enjoyed this video. Give me a thumbs up if you did. Subscribe to my channel when you're not ready. And see you next video.